heat sealing polyethylene foam. We put the two pieces real close together, apply a little heat, a little more heat. We have a good strong bond. Let's do another one, Mark. Hmm. This is pretty simple. You can go ahead and pretty much do almost any size of block as long as you can get them close enough together. Pass a little hot air through there. The heat guns are available. Amazon.com carries them. You can get them at uh, Home Depot. They're pretty inexpensive, usually uh, 50 bucks or less. Uh, these are corner blocks we're doing today. Is that easy or what? And it works. It's a good solid seal. It's better than gluing them. Just line them up. Put the heat to it. No problem. You don't do this with polystyrene. Just polyethylene foam is the only one you can do this with. And you can buy this polyethylene foam at iretex.com. That's I-R-E-T-E-X.com. It's fast and pretty darn easy to do. Just gotta watch so you don't burn your fingers off the heat gun. Keep your, if you keep your fingers away from it, you'll do a good job. Okay, and this is the last one. Thanks, Mark, for showing us how to heat seal today. My pleasure, Mark.